Welcome to clickmyproject.com Project title An attack resistant trust model based on multidimensional trust matrices in underwater acoustic sensor networks. Let's see the abstract. In general, underwater sensor networks are the enabling technology for wide range of applications like monitoring the strong influences. A trust based routing scheme can be used to route around compromised nodes that attempt to accept the collaboration. In the existing system, the unique characteristics of the network make it possible to directly use these trust models. In the proposed system, the system proposes a novel attack resistant trust model based on multidimensional trust matrices, that is ARTMM for the underwater acoustic sensor networks. Also in ARTMM, multidimensional trust matrices including the communication energy levels are also considered. Let's see the flow diagram. First, the network is designed to the number of sensor nodes in the underwater area. Then, calculate the wing quality for all nodes. After that, a forward route request to transfer the data that collected by the sensor nodes. For that, it updates the neighbors to forward in the data. Then, the wing quality is checked. That is, it is able to forward or not is checked. If the quality is validated, then select the neighbor node to transfer data or else it again updates the neighbor nodes. After selection of nodes, it updated the trust. It checks the trust value of each node. Uh, if it is true, then it processes the data communication or else it again forwards the root request to find the another path. After the data communication, the performance is analyzed uh, with the existing system. Let's see the running procedure of our project. First, open the terminal window and go to the directory. Then type in this file name dot tci. Here, the nodes are created in the network and the source and the destination packets are all updated. Also, the broadcaster message by each and every nodes are updated in the time interval are also displayed. To see the simulation result, type LAM. This is the network admitted window. Here only we see the output. Open the main.nam file. This is the simulation window. Uh, to run the simulation, click play button. Here, the number of nodes are created in the underwater sensor network. Uh, then in the surface area the sonar balls are placed which are able to transfer data to the sink. You can speed up the process. Here all nodes in the acoustic area are moved. That is it was floated in under the water. The red color nodes are mentioned as the anchor node. The anchor node uh, work is it collects data from the sensor nodes and it goes to the sonar balls and it transfers data to the sonar balls. After that, it is transferred to the base station. The anchor nodes move across the uh, entire area in the underwater and it collects data from each and every sensor nodes in the network.
you can see that this anchor node now it uh, transfers the collected data to the sonar board here the remaining anchor nodes are moved to the uh, near the sensor nodes and it collects data after it collects data it just moves upwards in, to the surface area these are all uh, processed based on the link capability in the network after it transfers it, it again works to the underground yes the connected anchor nodes are going to transfer data to the same device Update key, it again comes below and ready to collect data from the sensor nodes. This process will continue done during the entire simulation period. To see the performance results, back to the terminal window and type GNU plus platform. Here the test value is calculated according to the mobility of the nodes. So the mobility of the nodes is represented as a uh, meter per second and the node test value is calculated. Here the three comparison is processed. The existing works are the PMM and the MBB TV. Our proposed system is ART ML. So we achieve the high trust uh, value in our proposed system. You see on the graph back to the terminal and the type is in the plot file dot plot. Here the attacker reduction is mentioned here. So malicious attacks are represented in X axis and the reduction rate is represented in Y axis. Our proposed system is represented as ART which is protection rate is highly achieved than the other existing system. Thus, the overall performance of the network is increased than the existing system.